In four incredible years under the Trump administration, we've achieved more than any administration in the history of our country, actually. We passed record tax cuts and record regulation cuts. We achieved all-time low unemployment rates, record low poverty rates. We had the lowest, think of it, we had the best in terms of poverty, the best numbers you've ever had, and rising wages for everyone, wages that rose at a level never seen before. We ended the NAFTA disaster, canceled the TPP, which would have taken all of your business out of Pennsylvania, withdrew from the ridiculous Paris Climate Accord. I want to call it the Pennsylvania Climate Accord, not the Paris Climate. No, they were ripping us off. We had to pay a trillion dollars. Russia had to pay nothing. India had to pay nothing. China had to pay nothing. We had to pay a, a trillion dollars. I said, so far, the deal's not looking too good. I tell you what, as a business guy, you know, I went in and I looked at some of these deals. I said, who the hell negotiated these deals? There's some hanky-panky going on, I think. Of course, Biden got a lot of money from China, you know. They never say that. The fake news never talks about it. Somebody, if that were me, if that were me, I'd be excoriated. Remember I said at the debate, I said, let me ask you, how come the mayor of Moscow's wife paid this man three and a half million dollars? And Chris Wallace said, well, oh, please don't ask him that question. Two weeks later, it became a hot subject, you know? Don't ask him the question. And nobody really did ask him the question, right? I won the big case in Florida. He had a similar type of case, but the difference is I have Pre Presidential Records Act. Mine was 100% fine. I won it. I beat deranged Jack Smith. He's a deranged individual. But, but Biden had a similar case, but he didn't have Presidential Records Act, right? And Biden was essentially convicted. Think of this. Here was the decision. He's incompetent, so he doesn't have to stand trial. So think, think of this. He's incompetent, so he doesn't have to stand trial but he's allowed to be the President of the United States. Does that sound good? I don't think so.